Hello, my name is Jada Lopez, and I am working towards becoming an educator. Becoming an educator was not something I knew I wanted to do right away. It took my own experiences inside the classroom as a student to discover if this journey was for me. As a student who struggles with learning in the traditional classroom structure, I was frequently left behind while my peers excelled in their own academic progression. It was not until I outreached myself and found new ways of learning that accommodated my different learning style. Technology was that opportunity for me. I was able to grow in new ways that made sense to me. The connections of new concepts and ideas became tangible for the first time in a long time. Being a visual learner has its own barriers in itself, but my one learning style does not include the diverse minds that will exist inside a classroom. And when these modifications are not made to material that is being taught, then it will leave a lot of folks behind. Technology is a great way to meet these challenges because it allows teachers to create material in new and different ways that start to create inclusion among every type of learner. For example, a great tool to think about using for my learning style, visual learner, is the application tool Jamboard. Jamboard is a great tool for teachers and students alike. This tool allows students to build communication, collaboration, critical thinking, and creativity. Jamboard gives students a place to brainstorm together while developing new ideas as a unit. Engaging students to develop their thinking by problem solving. Giving students the technology to quickly relay their thinking. Tools such as these are an easy way for teachers to work towards a student-centered classroom that accommodates every learning style. Another example of inclusive tech resources is free online assistive technology that translates text into different language in real time, verbally and in print. This is another barrier that technology can allow students to overcome inside the classroom. ELL students can have a very hard time adjusting to a new world. Culture shock is real. This, in collaboration with jumping into a school that doesn't understand you, can be extremely overwhelming and hinder the real learning and progression that can happen due to reactions to the changes in their own environment. Technology allows teachers to give homework that can be changed into new mediums that gives students the freedom to express their learning in multiple ways. This learning could be a podcast, newsletter, movie, essay, and more. Using technology doesn't only benefit the student. It gives teachers a much more accessible and easy way to grade and monitor student progression. Canvas is a great example of that. The tool gives teachers a scope and sequence of student academic standing and also a simple way of organizing their content for the quarter using the modules feature. Often, Technology has a bad rep for being a distraction to students, when instead that is the opposite of what it can be. If used correctly and responsibly, this tool is a look into the future of education as a whole and should not be ignored in a cyber society we live in today. Students are actively using technology and know their way around the tool. Instead of pretending it doesn't exist and banning it from the classroom, Let's become open-minded to change and start to understand the true benefits of technological integration inside the education system. The ISTE standard, Creative Communicator, says, Students communicate clearly and express themselves creatively for a variety of purposes using the platforms, tools, styles, formats, and digital media appropriate to their goals. The key to integrating technology is the chance to build a classroom culture that supports a student-centered curriculum. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I hope you have taken away some insight of just how important technology can be if used correctly. Before judging the idea, how about you give it a shot?